What's going on? Jesse Irwin here in the Strip. The Pittsburgh Penguins are about to face off in a tough Stanley Cup final against the Nashville Predators. So we decided to come on down here and ask some of the fans what advice they might have for their hometown team. If you're the Penguins, you're going into the Stanley Cup final against a really tough Nashville team. What's the one thing the Penguins really need to do in order to win this series? They need to score. Score Some, goals. Yeah. Score, score goals. goals. Yeah. What's up everybody, Jesse Irwin here for KDKA for the second season in a row. Pittsburgh is home to Lord Stanley's Woo! Cup. And now there's only one thing left to do. Every, I'm about to get arrested. Are you tired of these parades? No, no, they, they, every year. We can do this every year for the next 10 years and then hopefully the Pirates win. What's that other sports team in town? I can't forget their name. I don't, the they, River Hounds. The, the River Hounds. The River Hounds. Yeah, right, very good. Right, right, right. Yeah, I come to the River Hounds parade. You kind of tired of these parades, man? No way. We're going for the three peat, baby. Three peat. We haven't even celebrated <laughs> the even second said, one. No, we're it's, doing three peat. It's oh. been three days, and you're already thinking about the next one. Come on, who's not? We're all ready for this. All right, I got. You mind if I? You have to hold this cup, on. Nicholas, how did you get down here today? Elvis, what does it feel like to constantly be forced to leave the building? You know what? When we take home a win, it is amazing. That's what I'm saying. You're getting kicked out of the stadium every time. Yeah, but it's that's my job. Give me three words to describe winning the Stanley Cup. Overwhelming, breathtaking, and exciting. It's like my bar mitzvah. If you have to give me three words to describe winning the Stanley Cup, what are those words? Penguins, let's penguin. Penguin, let's penguin. Am I right? <laughs> Nailed it. Are you excited for game seven tonight? Do I have anything on my face? That would be nice. How about them bucko? Hey. <laughs> I'm here with, what's your name? Colleen Salvatore. And? Brian Bellini. Bri Hi, Brian. Hi, how you doing? Are you guys brothers? Uh, no. No. Just um, friends. friends. Just friends. Yeah. Like best friends or like just kind of like friends? No, just good friends. friends. Yeah, good friends. Good friends. That was a good middle answer. Yeah. It was like, I like you, but not that much. Yeah. yeah. Favorite player? On the Crosby. I have, He autographed my hat. No, what? Yeah. Well, look at that. Oh, he stitched it in, no, too. No, he signed it, then I went to the place and had somebody stitch it. Ah. And I have his shirts. Where'd you go, Lids? Yes. OK, nice. You get him to, if they sign it, you take it there, they'll stitch right over the signature. Yeah. Can I sign your hat? No, you're okay. not a penguin, only right. penguin. Okay. <laughs> you're a woolly guy. <laughs> I'm a woolly guy. Elvis, thanks a lot. Keep hey, leaving there. the building. What's going on, Pittsburgh? Jesse Irwin here for KDKA. There are so many thrills you can find all over Western PA. So we decided let's come down to Kennywood and talk to some of those thrill seekers and ask them why they even do it. And if we have time, maybe we'll, I don't know, seek out some of our own. You guys are going to ride roller coasters today? Yeah, definitely. So you're all about the thrills in life. Why are you doing these things when you could just stay at home and watch, like, Netflix? Because I do that every other day. Like, when you go down on a roller coaster, yeah, like your you heart get drop. butterfly, then your heart drops. Why go on something as scary as a roller coaster when you could just sit and feed the ducks? Personally, I feel like feeding ducks doesn't give as much thrill as a roller coaster might. And Oh, you'd be surprised. John, where are you from? I'm from Florida. We're in Florida. Pensacola. I'm in the Army, so I move around a lot. So I'm in the process of moving to Arizona. Awesome. Thank you for your service. Yeah. What uh, What's the craziest thing you've ever done in your entire life? Um, well, I, I flew an airplane while I was in Iraq for a couple hours. Uh, that was pretty crazy. So nothing too insane. What's your name, sir? Sully. Sully. Sully, like the pilot, thank you so much for everything you do. What is the craziest thing you've ever done in your entire life? Tell me. I can't discuss that right now. <laughs> OK, uh, go on. 
Next up is the Sky Coaster. Sky Coaster is hands down one of the scariest things you can do here at Kennywood. It's also the most public, so everyone in the entire park can look and watch you screaming your face off as you're going and flying across the lake. So I'm, I'm, I'm freaking out. Oh my gosh, I am high up.